My name is uh, Bart Meus. I'm a professor of forest ecology and management at the University of Leuven in Belgium. My research team is uh, responsible for uh, the study of the soil biological activity in the Fundiv Europe network. And uh, particularly, we are looking at uh, the activity of earthworms, uh, microorganisms, and the humus type. Charles Darwin is known by many of you for his evolution theory, but few people know that he was also an earthworm researcher, a first earthworm researcher who published his last book on the formation of vegetable mold through the action of worms. He observed in his own garden that earthworms are very important for soil work, for bioturbation. And today we know that earthworms are worldwide ecosystem engineers which provide very important ecosystem services like uh, water drainage in the soil profile, erosion control, uh, and nutrient turnover. In European forests, there's uh, not so many diversity of earthworm species. But uh, in all the forests, we have uh, three important uh, ecological categories. We have epigeic earthworms, endogeic earthworms, and anisic earthworms. Epigeic earthworms live in the litter and uh, feed on this litter. While endogeic earthworms, they live in the soil and make burrows to um, eat soil organic matter. And then the anisic earthworms, they make vertical burrows where they live in. And during the night, they come at the surface to feed on the litter. Since quite a long time, we know that uh, earthworms are influenced by tree species. So there's a very important species identity effect on earthworms. For example, uh, tree species with palatable litter, like uh, lime trees or ash trees, they have a favorable effect on earthworm populations. While uh, tree species uh, which have acidifying litter like spruce or beech have a negative effect on earthworm populations. But as to tree diversity, um, the effect of tree diversity on soil biological activity is much less known and is quite unsure. For the moment we know, for example, that um, a monoculture beech forest can have uh, a very high diversity in uh, soil microarthropods. Micro and that is probably due to the fact that uh, the thick litter layer on the beach creates uh, a large structural diversity of habitats. Our observations in the Fundiv Europe uh, project um, show that there might be a slight uh, positive effect of tree diversity on uh, earthworm populations. And that could be maybe explained by uh, a larger variety in uh, food uh, availability.